Hey, this is John Cena, WWE Superstar and 15-time champ, and you are watching Miss WWE Fan 13. You can't see us. Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome to today's video. Today's video is going to be a belt review, and obviously, you guys see from the title, it's going to be a review of my Intercontinental Championship. So as you see here, I have it hanging on the wall, um, just next to my United States Championship. So I'm going to take this off, and let's get ready to review it. All right, guys. So here's an overview of the belt. Uh, I'm going to read off a little bit of facts about this belt. Um, so the plate material is made of zinc alloy, meaning all this stuff. And then we have the strap, obviously the white strap, is made out of polyurethane. So I'm guessing that's kind of like a polyester. The strap dimensions from this side to this side are uh 49.61 inches by 9.45 inches by 0 0.2 inches and then the largest waist size meaning your largest waist you can have in order to wear this around your waist 44 inches the actual weight of the entire belt is 5.29 pounds and in metric it's 2400 grams for the, of those of you who are not in the united states and then of course it comes with Let's see, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 16 strap fasteners over here. And then 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 little things right here to wear the belt. And then um, it, does it does come with a cloth carrying bag, but I have it put away because I have this belt hanging as you saw. And then the plates, the main plate is 11.02 inches by 8.54 inches, so meaning this is the main plate. And then... The first side plates, I'm assuming, are these, are 3.5 inches by 3.54 inches. And then the ones on the other side are 3.11 inches by 3 inch, uh, inches. So if you guys were probably asking me in the last video, how did you remember all those facts? Well guys, you know, it's called something called WWE Shot Facts right there. So lastly, the plate thickness right here is 0.2 eight inches so to give a better um i guess overview i'm gonna start from left to right so here as i said it comes with all the snaps and then engraved into it you see all the little engravings into the title uh leather and then he has the ww logo and then i have luke harper's signature right there and then here we have the first side the two side plates are pretty much just almost the same this one they're in like a grapple and then this one um, I guess kind of like a submission. I guess you would say I'm not really sure how to describe that and remember this has the older WWE logo on it So coming to the main plate on the top we have the old WWE logo and across here We have the stars and it says intercontinental and then more stars are here the uh, The globe in the middle and it says heavyweight wrestling champion and it has like stars right here So I really like this plate. It's really really nice looking next we have pretty much the same side plates on the other side, again, with the old WWE logos, and then the WWE logo that says Intercontinental, and over here we have Dolph Ziggler's autograph, and the little snaps. And on the back, as usual, it's just plain black, just, you know, with the bolts and everything, to how the belt's put together. But remember, one very important thing I said. If your belt does not have official WWE the authentic patch right here, it is not a real replica belt. You see how it says WWEshop.com, uh, replica championship title. That is how you know it's real. So yeah guys, that is the end of this review. I hope you guys enjoyed. This was a belt many, many of you guys have been wanting me to review. And I can see why, it's a nice belt. Um, now if you guys are wondering, would you, do you recommend buying this belt, like this one? Mine is different than the one they have right now. Mine has, like I said in the review, mine has the old logo. But, whichever one you buy, I definitely recommend it. This belt is very nice. It's probably one of the favorite ones I have. Probably my second favorite one I have. Um, it's just amazing overall, so. I recommend buying it, if, whether if you want the new one or the old one with this title, with this, uh, I mean logo, sorry. So, yeah guys, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and comment down below which belt you want me to review next. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video.